expect it to grow at about 2.9% a year going forward. The Asia-Pacific economies are expected to grow on average 3.8% a year, led by the non-OECD region. While, this is, while there is significant economic progress, the energy used to achieve this progress is tempered by leaps in efficiency. And in order for this, in order for this to become a reality, 500 quadrillion BT of energy efficiency must be found globally in 2040. These trends have significant implications for the lube industry, with the need to support technologies that enable improved energy efficiency and fuel economy, protection for engines and equipment that operate in more severe operating conditions, as OEMs try to get more performance out of a smaller machine, and increased focus on resource cons conservation, uh, which will drive uh, a trend towards longer term Should have picked earlier. Uh, the net impact on the lubricant industry is that the overall global demand is expected to grow modestly at about 1 to 2 percent a year for the rest of this decade and at a slightly higher rate uh, in the 80 countries in the Asia-Pacific region during the same period. While volume growth is expected to be modest, there is a significant shift in product mix with increasing drive towards high quality improvements. Demand growth forecast for high quality synthetic lubricants is, is significantly higher than growth forecasted for total loops. Global demand for synthetics is expected to grow at about 5 to 6 percent per year and even faster at 6 to 8 percent a year in the Asia Pacific region. Strong growth is expected across all segments of the market for synthetic lubricants because they enable improvements in energy efficiency and fuel economy, protection for equipment operating in severe operating conditions, and have long training capabilities. At ExxonMobil, we believe synthetic, the synthetic market segment to be a significant business opportunity and are actively investing in both technology and plant assets to support that growth. We recently announced that we'll be constructing the world's largest high viscosity polyalpha olefin plant to manufacture the newest addition to ExxonMobil's line of synthetic base dogs, Spectrosynthelene and Alice This new plant will augment our existing manufacturing assets in North America and Europe and allow us to reliably supply advanced synthetic based stocks to the innovative group marketers 